Hello dudes and dudettes, welcome back to Valhelsia Fabric. Guys, today we got some fun stuff planned, so let's get right into it. So, off camera, on actually a stream, uh, we went ahead and got a whole bunch of materials, though we didn't get this on stream. Uh, we went ahead and got an enchanting table and set up a spider spawner. I'll go ahead and take you guys over to that now. So just over here, about 150 blocks away from the base, uh, we have a cave spider spawner uh, that I have been, you know, slashing away the spiders and getting a bunch of levels here. Uh, yeah, so they just come here, we spawn in. This is the shulker craft design. Uh, I like it a lot. And uh, we have, you know, Crop Reaper, which isn't very useful, but Crop Reaper 3, uh, a breaking 3 and efficiency 4, great work pick. And then we have... Uh, I'm breaking three efficiency, efficiency four crop reaper three and fortune three. So I've been going uh, down to Y level 11. That's right, 11, and mining a bunch, getting a bunch of iron, getting a bunch of diamonds, and having a great time. So with all of that mining, uh, yeah, we have a lot of iron now, which is what we're going to be focusing on uh, today is what we can do with that iron. Because if you guys remember last episode, we hit a limit of you know what, how much iron we could have. And the thing we wanted to make was the uh, jackhammer, which allows us to mine a 3x3 three three area. But we needed quite a few things, so we're going to be making some progress towards uh, these things today. Um, so let's see... Uh, what do we want to start with first? I think we're going to start with the industrial electrolyzer, if we can. Um, yeah, so this me we have a compressor, which is good. Uh, we need to make some of this, and we do have a grinder. Okay, so let's get started. We're gonna take some of this here, throw some coal into the grinder. We'll take the other coal and toss it into the generator, so that way it's powered through the whole process. All right. So now that that's getting processed up, we're gonna go ahead and take a little bit of copper here and some rubber. We're gonna make some insulated cables. Uh, oh, gonna make them like these. Bam, so now we got quite a bit more, which is always great. And so we can add those guys back there. We're gonna make a, a few more of these. Uh, we need refined iron. All right, so we're gonna grab two of these, make two stacks of refined iron because we're cool all right with all that going uh let's go ahead and see about upgrading some of those so it means we gotta go to the nether and uh get some glowstone we we'll grab some blocks and we're gonna make our way over to the the nether okay so i found some glowstone over there which we need to get uh so yeah let's make our way over Getting shot at by a blaze. That's not good. That could end very poorly for us. It's not a very good shot, though, so we might be okay. Oh, there, yeah, that's the end. Let's try this again. We're back here. Uh, got the stuff back. We did lose quite a few levels, which is pretty unfortunate. Um, but we will easily get this back with our cave spider farm. All right. I don't see the blaze anymore, so I think we're okay there. But I just heard a, a gas, so I want to get our stuff and get out of here. Okay, so we are back from the nether. We got quite a bit of glowstone created. Uh, let me get rid of some of this material we don't need. Okay. So, uh, let's see, do we need anything in here? Not really. Uh, but we do need some of you, some of you. Anything else smelting up here? How are we doing on you? Oh, we're doing pretty good. Cool. So, let's get the carbon fiber, and we can compress the... Oh, no, we got to put these guys together. Just like so. 
And then we compress those. Perfect. Okay. So we got those made. Let's make let's work. Let's work on these. Uh, we need some mixed metals. We need refined iron, bronze, and tin. Did we find a way to make bronze last time? Yes, we did. That's right. Remember I went really dumb and I was trying to use power on this and it wasn't working? Yes, yeah, okay. So we're making that. What was the bottom? Please don't be tin. Please don't be... Uh, it was tin. The good thing is we use a whole lot more of the other materials, not tin. So I need to go looking for tin off camera. So that's good to know. Okay. Oh yeah, look at all that bronze. Okay, so now we can make the cool dudes. Alright, we can smelt this guy up. Mixed metal ingots, very good. And then we will compress those after the advanced alloys. All right. So we need two extractors. So we need one, two, three, four of these. Right? Yeah, because there's, oh, well, we just need a couple. Some redstone, let's make that. Okay, let's make some more those a solid canning machine interesting now we also need a bunch of wood for some taps uh, so let's do that I don't know why I did it like this Maybe because I wanted to do that all right All right, there we go. We got our extractors. Okay. So now that this is done, if we check here, yep, we got our advanced boy. And then we need some iron plates as well. We just actually need four of those. We just need two of these to process. So after two of these are done, we can switch over the iron and then create our machine. Cool. The blast furnace is also going to be quite difficult. And we're also going to need to look at more generators as well. All right, so the iron's going. Uh, let's see here. Can make this guy. We should tell us what we're missing. We need some lapis. Now we can make these. Two of them. Because we're cool. Oh, not there. Alright, so we're just missing the iron plates now. The coal is done. Cool, those are getting processed. Make the carbon fiber. Uh, combine the carbon fiber. We can compress more of those, but we can't do it just yet. Where did I, oh yeah, that's right, we already made it. So let's go, where did the plates go for, with, with our advanced alloys? We already made those, so we're good. All right, so come on, come on, come on. Perfect. So we have enough to make the industrial electrolyzer. All right, so put that guy there. Yep, that's getting good. Perfect. Now I believe we throw the bauxite in here that we have, and this will give us tin. No. Why did we need that? Um, titanium, a blast furnace. Okay, so clearly this is our next goal, right? But what was the other thing? Lithium. Okay, assembling machine. Aluminum, was this why we needed it? A blast furnace. Industrial electrolyzer. Where do you get this? Red garnish. You freaking kidding me, more? Okay, we, need, we got a lot to do. 
Okay, false alarm. So all we need to do is just grind up the bauxite dust. When we throw it in the industrial electrolyzer, it splits off into aluminum and titanium. So that's all we need. Uh, we also need a little bit of tin to make some of those cells. Like so. So we can go ahead and put those in here. And then the bauxite dust. Are you done yet? Yeah, we got four. Cool. So we can put the bauxite dust here and it should... Oh, I think I might need 20. Oh, we need 12. Okay, so it starts with 12. We need uh, more empty cells, though, that's for sure. All right, there we go. Gonna put these guys in here. We got another four. Actually, I'm not throwing one on the ground. <laughs> we got eight total. Okay, so while that's processing, we can go ahead and create another one. I want to go ahead and make the industrial blast furnace now. So we need two electric furnaces, which require two iron furnaces. Okay, so iron furni. There we go. There's the two electric furnace. Uh, we need another one of those, so we do need to compress two more of those, which is okay. Should have more. Yes, sir. Okay. Then these guys, copper and nickel. How do we get nickel again? Where do we get the nickel dust? From an industrial grinder. Really? Is that the only way to get nickel? What about the ingots? Industrial centrifuge. Or an industrial grinder. Oh. Hold up. That didn't look too difficult to make. Industrial centrifuge. That's what we're gonna make. Yeah, we could make that actually pretty quickly. Uh, yeah, we should have more taps. Let's see, does this work allow us to create the taps? It sure does, perfect. All right, extractor, bam. Just need two of these, bam. And then refined iron, and we need, oh, okay, so we do need a couple more of those. I have enough, I can make one right now. Ah, uh, but we need two. All right, so we got the two here, so we can go ahead and create the second one of this. I believe that's everything we need. Yep, industrial centrifuge, perfect. Break this guy, put him there. We can put this guy here. We definitely need to look into making more generators to help us out with power. Uh, but now it's the raw copper, which we do have. Amazing. So put that in there. That's going to spin it around. Kind of looks like it's spinning. If you really think about it, it's kind of spinning. You know, it's going to spin it around. And we can put this in there. Yeah, okay. Let's look up another generator. And by looking up the generator, this guy here. That's right, this one's super easy to make. We're gonna make two of these guys. Oh, we don't have any lead for the cables. Did we use all the cables? There's no way we used all those cables. Okay, but we do have another one of those batteries lying around. So we can just go ahead and make a quick one of these. Don't even need to do that. And we got our second. Uh, where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? There you go. Second generator. To go ahead and help out with some power. Like so. That way, that should be good. Wow, that's taking a while. Oof, these are taking forever. 
my dude. Okay, so those are getting created. We have we made the industrial centrifuge. Don't need to worry about those. Uh, industrial blast furnace. Yeah, this is giving us. We're getting the nickel from the industrial centrifuge. Yeah, that'll give us gold and nickel. Okay. But iron gives us the most nickel by a lot. Two iron gives us three of the nickel ingots. And that's just the, the raw iron. Okay. I don't have any raw iron left, so copper's going to have to do. Oof. All right, but I need to do some AFK and let these guys process up, and I'll be back in just a jiffy. Okay, so a little bit of time has passed, and we are now crushing up some uh, diorite. Uh, you might be asking why. Well, because you eventually want to go ahead and make a windmill, uh, because this thing produces, let's see, about four times more power per one. Uh, and I'd like to convert each of these into a windmill, which would be fantastic, but we need aluminum, and we need this magnesium dust. And to get the magnesium dust, uh, we need to put some marble dust in the industrial centrifuge and to get the marble dust we need diorite dust and a smile pile of obsidian dust so we have plenty of the obsidian dust just went through and collected a bunch of obsidian uh, but we need to go ahead and kind of crush up the obsid or the the diorite and then i also went ahead and stole all of the aluminum dust out of here because we'll need that to uh, make the plates so now that that's done um we need to go ahead and make an industrial blast furnace now and i believe we have all of the materials to make it i just had a bunch of rubber right here get smelted up we got a little bit here uh, we're gonna grab this guy this guy this guy this guy okay uh i believe do we have our refined iron we still do perfect we're gonna grab some of this and some copper so we can make some cables. Insulated copper cable. I guess they're, oh, up, up and down. Perfect. All right. So let's see about making one of these. Uh, so we need, oh, that's right. We need our nickel, which we did get. Uh, I actually switched up what this guy was doing uh, last night uh, up to iron because we were getting a lot bigger uh, output of nickel. Um, so that's why that seems a little different. We also got a bunch of tin as well. So always excited to get more tin because we can make more of those cells. Oh man, but then we also need to worry about power generation as well, which if you see the bamboo, I've got an idea that we might be using with those guys. So we'll see how that works out eventually. But let's get right into the meat and gravy here. What are we missing? Oh, we're missing the redstone. Perfect. We're going to use all of those to make them. Perfect. Okay, let's grab some glowstone. We got the redstone. We're going to grab some lapis. So we need to make some advanced circuits. I think we only need three. Uh, we need to make a basic this guy, a basic machine frame, a basic this guy. That's that's exactly what I just said. Okay, and then we need some copper. I, I thought we had everything, but I guess we didn't. Copper and nickel. Nickel. Is this a thing? Uh Oh, this is in a rolling machine. Frick. Uh we need to make this guy then. Okay. Uh so it looks like we just need two compressors. These are super simple to make. Okay. So we just need some smooth stone. Let's get that smelting up for us. I thought that was in a crafting table. My bad. All right, so we're gonna make the rolling machine now. Um, so here we go, basic dude. We need to make two compressors. What am I missing? Hold up, what, what are we missing? Oh, is it another machine? Yeah, it's another machine guy, okay. 
So here we go, we got those two. We need to make a third one. And that, uh, we're just missing the pistons. Redstone, we got some wood, we just need some cobble. There we go. Rolling machine, bam, there we go. That's what we needed. I will put this guy here, so that's getting power. And now, let's see. Nickel in the corners. And copper here. Yes, that's working. Perfect. All right, so let that go for just a few minutes there. Um, so now that the rolling, now that these guys are being made, we can check out the industrial blast furnace. Uh, so we need to look at making one of those. One of these. I just get rid of my roof. Well, where's my iron? My iron. There we go. Oh, I still had it. Okay, and then where are my plates? Got the carbon. Ah, there's the plates. So now we can make this guy. We need to make one more of these. So we need, we need some redstone and some glowstone. There we go. And so, hold up. Two electric furni. We got one here. There should be one more somewhere else. like we've only got one. Oh, I've got if we grab the wrench we can use the other electric furnace because I'm not really using the electric furnace up here. So we can just borrow that. Yeah, that's where the second one was. I put it down here for some reason. Alright, so we got all of the, the heating coils that we need. So that means industrial blast furnace. Good to go. Alright, we got it. Put that guy here. Incomplete multi-block. Oh, it's a multi-block? So lava in the middle, what are those? Um, let's check it out, Tech Reborn. What, what else, what are we missing? Standard machine casing. Okay, so I think we can use just iron plates or aluminum. We're gonna use probably iron plates for this. So those look to be the same. So I need. Oh uh, well, let's take it outside. Hang on, let's go to sleep. Okay, let's make sure we've got this right. Place it here. Yeah, those are the, the right stuff that we need. Where's the skeleton shooting me from? Where is you? Oh, there you are, you're in the water. Okay, so yeah, those are what we need. Um, I don't have a designated spot for it just yet. We might need to expand down in, and make a basement for this, which would be pretty interesting to make. Um, yeah, let's get the iron plates compressed. Actually, we have enough iron plates. We need a lot of tree sap. Okay, so I'm gonna gather the materials and then we'll build that together. And there's a creeper up on that hill. Okay, so some more time has passed. Uh, we got a bunch of the, the diorite dust now, and uh, we have everything we need to make 
Uh, enough of these guys. Did the math. We need a total of 36 of them. Uh, now we need to go... Uh, we need another bucket. We need to grab some lava down below. I can totally just remember that now. Alright. To lava and beyond. Alright, so this is where I've been getting my obsidian here. Um, so we should... Yep. Cool. Oh, almost threw it into the lava. That would have been great. <laughs> All right, so let's see about building this guy. Um, I think we're going to put him outside. Oh, well, let's fire tick on. Uh, game rule. Give me a second. Okay, so we've disabled fire tick just for now, uh, so we don't burn down our our whole house. Um, let's let's put some flowers down, guys. Okay, we're gonna put this guy right here. Uh, so it's gonna be one, two, three, one, two, yeah. So we build. This up. And we place the lava at the bottom, and then the lava at the top, and then we seal this. All right. And then we come down here. Yes. Okay. So the industrial blast furnace is working. So do we have to run power like straight to this guy? Actually. Do I have any rubber in here? Nope. Uh, I've also discovered something really cool uh, to do with the rubber that I want to share with you guys. So we collect four of the uh, sap, and if we put it into the industrial... Actually, I think I've already told you that. Did I tell you this already? You put four in, you get like 14. I mean, that's a pretty good rate. I don't know if I told you guys that before. I feel stupid if I have. Okay, I want to see something. If, can we just, like, break this and run a cable to it? Um, does that work? No, so I'm pretty sure we have to run it directly to this guy. Okay. We can manage that. Uh, we're, gonna, we're not going to be able to use the insulated ones all the way, uh, but we can make some more of the high-voltage cable. Gives us 12 per. I forget how good of a yield that is. Okay. <clears throat> so let us break this fun. Nope, oh, this one. And we will put that back. Give me that one. Okay. So I assume this is going to use quite a bit of power. Um, actually, let's just use this. Can we use this one? Oh, we can. Cool. Whoops. Don't attach. Don't be too hasty. All right. So we run this over. Now is this getting power? Sure is. Okay. So that's a little inconvenient. I wish this was, you know, not so ugly. Uh, but now we do have the ability to turn our aluminum into aluminum ingots, which I'm happy about, which means we are one step closer to this guy. Uh, we can get our aluminum plates, and then we got to worry about lithium cells. Clay dust in an empty cell is all we need. How do you get clay dust? By putting clay into a grinder, of course. Of course. That is what we need to do. All right, let's get that taken care of. I, what the? Oh. All right, quite a bit of time has passed. I'm sorry, guys. They're, like The titanium ingots that I just crafted up took about 30 minutes for both of them to smelt. Uh, we also got some Electrum off camera. All you do is just put gold and silver into this guy over here, and you get Electrum. So super easy, but we are getting much closer uh, to creating this. We just need to make the lithium cells. Um, let's see. What am I looking for? Looking for some clay stuff. Or did I already get that in there? 
Aha, I found it. Okay. So this stuff here, we need to put it into something. Am I out of tin? Am I really out of tin? No. I'm not. Okay. So one, two, three, four. There we go. We got 16 of these guys. All right. So we need to throw the clay dust in here with some empty cells. Uh, this, whoops. This will give us... Uh, the lithium cells we need. So we only need two of these to process up since it takes about 55 seconds. Uh, so it'll give us about two minutes here. And then after we have that, we combine these in an assembly machine. And that is what the Electrum was for. Uh, we need to go kill some squid. So let's sleep real quick. We're getting really close to getting this advanced uh, rock cutter. and I'm super excited about it. All right. So let us see, where are the Squidwards? That's a skeleton, kind of close. Another skeleton, he's shooting at me, missing pretty bad. Um, hello, Squidward, where are you? Aha, we have our first victim, I mean, a squid ink donator. Our second one, can I do it before we run out of air? Knockback does not help. All right, now we just need Juan more. There he is. Come here, Squidward. There we go. Okay, we got all of that that we need. Okay, so with the black ink now available to us, we can take some aluminum plates. I do have six in here. We'll save two. And then what else do we need? Uh, just a glass pane. What a pane. There we go. Bam. And we can make the digital display very good. All right, so that's that. We need one of these guys. Okay, so we need some more advanced alloy. Uh, which is refined iron, bronze, and tin. Should have a bit of refined iron left, I believe. We're gonna need a little more. Cool, we got the two lithium cells, check it out. Um, so with the lithium cells, that means all we need is the assembly machine because we have the aluminum plates here which is fantastic uh, we're gonna put the rock cutter here we're gonna put the two titanium ingots and then we're gonna take the three diamonds and put it here so we have all of the materials separate but all we need to do is make the assembling machine now um one two three four we're gonna get these guys compressed up into plates all right Okay, we're gonna need quite a bit of the refined iron, but Oof. okay. So I need two of those. Do we have any in here? No. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, and that's gonna require some more. We do have some more iron. We can put Oh, this is running off the solar panel. That's funny. All right, so we got that. One, two, three, we got that. And then what was the middle guy? Bronze. Perfect. All right, these go. Oof. Uh, this gets smelted first, actually. Okay, so we're able to make this guy now. Uh, so all we need to do is make two more of those, uh, which shouldn't be too difficult now that we're actually uh, moving along with creating some good power. Not power, uh, creating some more iron, which is good. Okay, so yeah, we should have enough for those. Um, yep, we just need two. And then we need to go ahead and upgrade those. 
Bam, okay. So that part is made. So we got the Electrum plates. We got that, we got that, we got that, we got that. What are we missing? Oh, one piston. I believe I have, yes, we got one more there. Uh, yes, assembling machine, we got it, perfect. Okay, so this will go here. And now we put in these two guys, the lithium cells and the aluminum plates. And once these guys are done, we need to put some more of those in. Give all these guys a little bit of charcoal so they can make some power. And bam, our lithium battery is done. Okay, so this is everything. Advanced jackhammer. Guys, we freaking got it. Oh my goodness. What are we filling with power? Oh, probably the cable. Okay, let's test it out. We got 9% power here. Set to active, okay. So you just right click, then shift right click, okay. Let's give it a look. Oh my goodness. So 5K. So it takes a lot of power to do this. We're gonna probably need to make a uh, a backpack for it, but guys we have three by three mining this means that we can collect so many resources So the thing that we've been wanting to make this entire time is now in our possession The advanced jackhammer guys that is gonna wrap up the episode for today If you guys did enjoy the video, please make sure to hit that like button and as always don't forget to subscribe But this has been super turtle and I'll see you all in the next video. Take care. Peace out. Bye-bye